Hello there, and as usual, I'm Eric from Last Stand Gamers, and welcome. So today I just wanted to run a quick, really sort of cool concept by you guys. At the current moment in time, it's very visual and not very mechanical, but hopefully with some of the help of the coders in the community, I can get this coded up and working how I intend it. Now, the first few factors that we're going to take into consideration here is in a lot of multiplayer servers, you have a public station where lots of players are allowed to access lots of different areas, but then there's some areas that you want to keep private. And it can be quite hassling, but at the same time, you want more of a roleplay way of accessing that area. And this is my solution. First, there's a few different protocols that will be called forward through the scripting block. First, the sensor was going to detect the character number. So the character number is quite simply detected as, as if you select through, I believe it's the administrative menu. You can see the different characters in your world, and each one is uniquely identified. So you can allow certain characters through an area by using that said feature. So if we go to the door and we let this scan us. So we're just going to access this point over here. And we're going to press F. See if that will actually access it. The scanner has scanned me. And I'm accepted into this area. Very nice indeed. A simple and quite effective roleplay way of getting through to the next area. So we'll close this door back up and I'll shut up when it seals. Okay, so what I was thinking next is what about if you could only access this retinal scanner? Uh, for instance, when your mask is up. So if I go to this, pop my mask up. And go back to this. This was this is what I was trying to program in, but I, I just didn't understand how to do it. Um, hopefully, some maybe some scripters will have some sort of check or variable check that'll um, allow this to work. So, for instance, we'll hit that button again. Let this scanner scan us, and it should accept us once again because it's just programmed to accept that particular character in the area. Now, if I close this back up using that. Now, the, the other features that I wanted to do was. Detect an enemy. So if I detect an enemy, of course, it would signal a camera to look at the location. The camera's already actually pointing in this direction because I've been testing this through a variety of different things. And also go off three times. So say, for instance, I run away from the scanner so it doesn't complete a complete scan. The scanner just shuts off like that. Nothing happens. It only rises a sort of alarm when I scan through this three times or move away three times. Then something is drawn to the administration's attention. But getting them... In a position where they're not just sat at a control panel. Maybe you know, they'd have to be directly directed at the captain of the station. But I don't know how to particularly do that at the moment. So um, if we go to the camera. This is what I quite like. We've got the surveillance camera. And we can, can actually control these. This is a little modded block. You can actually see or be alerted to that particular surveillance camera. That something's going on in that area. And work out, work, sort of work out who it is. Oh, that's me. Look at my beautiful little beard. Back in that position. So this was just like a, a really simple concept video. Of me trying to show off how I'm going to try working on this ret retinal scanner. Just a different way of accessing doors. So if we do this key. This one, I believe. What's that one? That that's allows the security cameras to target me. I think it's actually targeted off in a different direction. Because I've not finished programming that in. So just an interesting way of accessing open through doors. A quick video. But anyway, if you've got any comments or further ideas of how to access through doors, i.e. retinal scanners or some sort of other system, I'd really like to know in the comments below. Anyway, I'll see you 